guys, we are back from the championship scramble, and, and Philip Fry is in this match. This will be his first appearance on in, on WWE television since Over the Limit, where he was forced to quit. But we don't, and everyone is on random. This is for the perfect time championship, so you can cash it in for a world title shot. Or any championship, excuse me, except the Jobber Division 1. Here we go. Here we go, here's who will be our first two competitors in this upcoming contest. And it is Eric Cartman, the former Mike from LA One champion. For the perfect time championship. And who will be the next contestant for Cartman? Braylon, oh, this ought to be interesting. The main quarterback of my NCAA 13 coaching carousel series versus the one of the first college football characters I've ever created. Cartman versus Bird. Here we go. And whoever gets the last pin will get the rematch. And we are guaranteed a brand new, the first ever perfect time championship. But wait, what's... Oh! So far, Braylon and Cartman are giving up that match that everyone wants to see. So here we go. We are 50 seconds away. I wonder when our next competitor is going to be. Here comes Fry. One. Nope. DDT to Cartman. And Cartman's already bleeding. And I guess Fry gets the dude. Fry does absolutely nothing.
Here we go. Our next competitor should be here momentarily. One, two, three. Braylon's the current champion. DDT again. Here we go. Ten seconds left to our next competitor comes. Who is it going to be? It's Daisuke Wakamatsu. And so far, this thing's. Here we go, next competitor, it is going to be John Turkey. Here comes 208. Let's see, we're getting closer to the end of this match. Mark Henry? What the hell?
somebody go and get their ass kicked. Almost. One, two. Nope. We got 90 seconds left of this championship scramble. No! Raylan Bird, he is one minute away from becoming champion. His first championship in WWE, even though this is one of those collector championships. Mark Henry is the current champion. Mark Henry is the champion. Mark Henry's the champion. Mark Henry is the perfect time champion. He can now cash in to become a champion of, of, of his choosing. And Brian's like, no. He lost his championship. He lost his career in Tampa Bay. And, and Mark Henry doesn't have a championship. Well, it's kind of be interesting who gets credited with the loss, so who gets the rematch. My guess is that I got credited with the loss, but now coming up next is our main event. The newly, not newly formed tag team, Dolph Ziggler and myself, versus the Funky Patriots. And hopefully no Vince Russo booking. And then I can wrap up today's filming and then I can play more of this game by creating <laughs> more cruiserweights. Here I come and we, sh we should come under under the same thing because well oh oh I'm sorry. Both of us. There's the huge cheers for Dolph. Hollywood, Florida, Dolph Ziggler. Here comes the Funky Patriots. And also, this is a little announcement. On Friday Night SmackDown, we will have a number one contenders match for the television championship. Whoever wins that match will face Brodus Clay at one night only. At one night only. Dolph Ziggler. And I'll forget at the over the limit kickoff, Dolph Ziggler faced Brodus Clay, but unfortunately Brodus Clay got annihilated. Here we go, we are underway. And he just went through Jack Swagger. What? And that's it. We won by disqual. The Funky Patriots won by a disqualification. All because I didn't. I thought I was hitting Swagger, but instead I hit the referee by accident. 
Oh well. So ladies and gentlemen, that's gonna do it. Let's take a look at the card the game gave us. Here, we got Christian versus Ted DiBiase. Kelly Kelly versus Brad Phoenix. We got Ali Ghirardelli in the Middle East for the Tag Team Championships. Highlight match Jermaine King versus Greg Colley. And our main event is Mark Henry versus Randy Orton. The, the number one contenders match, that's staying put. And whoever loses, well, congratulations, you're number one contenders for the World Tag Team Championships. So, good night, guys. I'll see you guys in the morning.